Snipers or rollovers? Which is worse for the turret gunner of a military vehicle? Obviously, the turret gunner is pretty exposed, especially during combat or during any training environment. But you have to realize this. If a gunner is properly doing his job and he's actually sitting the way he's supposed to sit, he's actually pretty well protected and he has a rather slim chance of actually getting hit by a sniper. And tactically, for a sniper to go after a turret gunner might be the worst decision ever because that's the one guy where if you miss, he's going to hear your shot, he's going to look right at you, and everyone's going to send America your way. If you look up rollover training accidents all over the internet, they flood your search feed of these accidents happening stateside. My point is you don't even need to be in combat or deployed for a rollover to take out soldiers. Also the turret gunner, you rely on the guy under you to hold you down. If he's not paying attention, this turret gunner is done.